My whole life, I mean, my name is Michael. I have always loved confusing people about my gender. Gender was always this incredibly fun thing to just play around with and hear. Oh, and, and I love performing. I love being on stage, but I can't sing, I can't dance, and I can't really act. I love doing all three of those. I just can't do them well enough that people will sit in the theater and want to see it. And so finding out that there was a way on stage and it was to do what I loved doing my whole life, I was over the moon. I really got started with drag in college, the night before the drag show. I had been practicing and I was so nervous. Um, and I was thinking, oh, you know, I barely have my clothes, like, I still need to learn like half this, half the lyrics to this song. I don't even have my name. This is going to be a travesty. And my brain just kind of did this thing. And I was like, Travis T. And I'm like, that is, that is self-descriptive. And so ever since then, I've been performing as Travis T. He's a terrible person. That's, that's what's so fun about being him. My drag persona has evolved a lot. Like Travis T, kind of, kind of the core of who I like to be is just um, a ladies man who's the best person on the planet and doesn't, doesn't have respect for anyone else, doesn't have to have respect for anybody else. Um, and that oversized ego, that oversized confidence is how I get up on stage. It's unintentionally the most confidence-building thing I've ever done.